Hello, ladies and gentlemen. Welcome back to this not a hardcore playthrough of WWF No Mercy. Well, the truth is, episode 5, I believe, got lost. So, unfortunately, you have to take my word for it that, yes, I went through it again. See, on the right-hand side, I went through it again with Steve Blackman, did some stuff, and he uh, kept his championship. So, Steve Blackman is the hardcore champion of this realm. So, let's just go ahead and get the heck out of here. Over to a new championship here. Champions. Now, I believe I made a joke about going through all of the uh, inactive, non-existent belts anymore. So I think from here, we're going to check out some high flyers. We're going to go for the light heavyweight championship at this point. So let's take a look here. If we're looking at light heavyweights, we are looking at maybe a legend like Chris Jericho. Maybe we're uh, <laughs> Scotty Too Hot and Grand Rich Sex 8. Oh, too cool. Love those guys. Rest in pre- Whoops. Rest in peace, Brian Christopher, Jerry Lawler's son. Um, let's see, who on here has actually held the light heavyweight championship? Probably Hardy's have at one time or another, one of them. That's right, I remember Matt Hardy and his uh, V1 days, his quest for the light heavyweight or cruiserweight championship or whatever. Got it. Um, uh, X-Pac definitely held the title for a while. Good choice, good choice. Um, Taka Michinoku, definitely, definitely a hard, uh, light heavyweight championship holder. Oh my god, I can't control this thing. But if I do that, he becomes Funaki. Smackdown, number one greatest announcer, who currently does announcing for the Japanese announced team in WWE. That's pretty neat. So we got a couple different, uh, Taka and Funaki skins here. Oh, we're going way down the line. Crash, Holly, you know, you can't be a light heavyweight at 400 pounds. <laughs> um, S.A. Rios, you know, he's so forgotten that I almost feel bad enough for him to choose him, but I'm going to pass. Um, the ladies, the ladies could do it. There were some female light heavyweight champions across the years. Um, they're certainly possible. And Cactus Jack. So you know what? I'm going to go ahead and cheat a little bit. I went with someone who, you know is definitely on people's, you know, boy lists, if you watch OSW reviews. Let's go with somebody who's on some of the all-time great lists. Lionheart, Chris, mother flippin' Jericho. Let's see, what do we have? We have the black with the pink boys, I like that. Um, ooh, nice little multicolored thing going on. We've also got, with his uh, Jericho-holic t-shirt, and let me guess, referee outfit number four? <gasps> Oh, snap. I think I have to. Is there anything else? Nope, nope. I gotta go with <laughs> the purple vest, Jericho. Yes, please and thank you. So here we go. Chris Jericho, still wrestling. AEW, former champion. And we're gonna go back in time, almost 20 years, as he tries to make his way to become the light heavyweight champion. Dean Malenko, one of the greatest technical wrestlers in the history of the game, grew up around wrestling with his father Boris being a legendary trainer. And yeah, no, Dean's legit. Dean's absolutely legit. This dude still in the business. I think he's an agent or a producer with WWE backstage, so that's cool. <coughs> what voice to give Dean Malenko? Oh, someone will compete tonight to become the number one contender for the light heavyweight championship. Who will it be? I'm not even sure who that is, but that's, that's Dean Malenko now. Since we have four superstars competing for the number one contender spot, we will have a four-way match. A fatal four-way. One of these four superstars will be you, Jericho! Haha, <laughs> yes. So, gotta remember, not doing hardcore rules, no weapons, gonna lose if that happens. Um, well, actually, will I? No, there's no DQ, that's right, it's a freaking fatal four-way match. Triple Threat and Fatal 4 matches are no DQ. <gasps> yes. Let's do it. Let's freaking do it. Chris Jericho, the aforementioned Grandmaster Sexay, Eddie Guerrero, and Takamichi Noku. Four-way, no requirements, progress whether I win or lose. I 
I'm of course going to try and win. You bet your sweet bippy I'm going to try and win this. Wow, look at the freaking banding on this old 64-bit logo. <laughs> Wait. Wait. <laughs> Just listen to the theme real quick, yeah. Yeah! I still remember back in 99 when he jumped ship from WCW over the WWF. It was huge. People were big, big on Jericho. Even though... The Rock kind of buried him on day one, but whatever. All right, yes, yes, we know about Grandmaster Sexay. Okay, we'll give him a second to go through. It's, it's the least we can do for uh, one of the fallen soldiers of wrestling. Rest in peace, Brian. Love you, buddy. And speaking of rest in peace, another amazing legend taken way too young. Oh, my God, this quality. I'm so sorry. <laughs> you know... It's just nostalgia goggles, I guess. I'm pretty sure, you know, if I was doing this not on a monitor versus like a CRT television, then yeah, it'd probably be better. Talking Michinoku, one half a Kai and Tai. Michinoku driver, yay, show it on your Titan Tron. Okay, there we go. All right. So let's do this thing by, get, by posing and getting the heck out of the ring. So it's a fatal four way match, but. They're making it look like it's elimination format. So I will continue to run. I'll continue to run as the screen flickers. And I'm just going to toss weapons in the ring. <laughs> Indiscriminately throwing crap. Stop in the name of pain. Sorry. Oh, a microphone. I thought I had nothing. And ha! All right, one more. Everybody gets a weapon. I want to make this a fair, fun fight. And that is, oh, a championship belt. Yeah. Let me see if I can go for a fifth. Oh my God, what in the hell's happened to the screen? Oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. Hold on, hold on, hold on. Ouch, ouch, hold on. Okay, let's see what that did. Uh, we're gonna run. Oh, we're still gonna flicker. Oh God. Oh God, oh God, what's happening? What's happening here? What in the world is this? Um, and throw a weapon. <laughs> I don't think I'm gonna find any more weapons. I'm just, I'll try, I'll try one more. Nope, okay, I'm back in. I guess you and me, Taka. We're gonna throw down. Let's see, what's my attack? Oh, nice, little kind of flying wheel kick thing. Oh. Oh, come on, really? I can't suplex... Swaba baba. I can't suplex you back in the ring? <laughs> oh, nice. He throws a dill blunderhook overhead suplex, too. Cool. Another shoulder tackle. Always appreciate it. Oh, you can't get me. I'm very privy to your attempts at low blows. And... Oh, yep. I get reversed. Hooray. And... Flying Crescent. Whoops. Nope. Let's try this grab. Scoop slam. And... Yeah. Okay, stand up. When I move, you move. Just like that. Hell yeah. Hey, DJ, bring that back. Oh, God. Light grab. And... Oh, sweet. Little uh, arm wrench and an elbow to the shoulder. All right. Oh, he ducked my microphone shot. Oh, no. <laughs> he doesn't want to hear what I have to say. From one of the greatest freaking promos of all time, Chris Jericho. And okay. Ooh, give me time to get up bat. Ooh, I can switch dudes. Nope, I didn't want to do that. Let's try picking up the championship title. And Eddie, you and me. Uh eat the belt. Eat the belt. I know it's supposed to be called a title, not a belt, because that's how Vince wants it. Oh yeah, the <laughs> The chairman, CEO, president, Vince McMahon. One thing that some people may or may not know, there are a list of words that you shouldn't or can't say in WWE. One of them, oh nice. Oh, that didn't know backbreaker variation existed. One of them being referring to the championship titles as belts. Granted, it didn't used to be like that back in the day, but nowadays, yeah. Oh, go back to the backbreaker. It's a back-to-back -back backbreaker. And baseball bat. 
Oh crap. Oh, beautiful drop kick. No. Nope. Okay. No. No. Okay. <laughs> if, if the pin's gonna happen and I'm not there, I'll be totally pissed. And I missed them both. Cool. Okay. All right, Grandmaster Sexy, your meter's getting a little too high for my liking. So I'm gonna. Oh, I guess not. No. Great. Yay! Back suplex. I don't think I'm gonna. Just, I'm, I'm gonna get out of here. I'm, I'm gonna get out of here and let you guys work on yourselves for a little bit. I'm just gonna, you know. Um, can, can I like? Oh, there we go. I knew I'd do it. Ooh. Oh, Eddie. Oh, Eddie. Ow! Again with the drop kick. Man, Eddie, stop throwing drop kicks. Not cool. Oh my God, we're flashing again. Is it? What, it was just only when I go outside of the ring. There's flashing. All right, screw it. Back in I go. Come on, Eddie. You too. You too, buddy. Please stop the flashing. Please stop. All right. Much better. Can't handle that much stuff. That many polygons at once. Even though the background is just like pre-rendered images and stuff bouncing up and down. Okay. Well, let's see here. And who can get hit? Nope, near too late. Darn. All right. Um, all right. I'll grab the mic and I'll hit Eddie. Hit Eddie. There we go. Not expecting it. Let's see. Knock him out of the ring. <laughs> that works too. Oh, and now it's going again. It's going again. Oh, God. Oh, God. Anything but this. Anything but this. Throw my own back suplex. Okay, Eddie's focusing on Grandmaster Sexay. I'll focus on Taka. I'll just keep on throwing stuff. Nice powerbomb, Eddie. Oh! Little flapjacky boy from Jericho. Ooh, what are my back moves? And back. Ooh, nice. Ooh, release of German suplex. Very cool. Yes, let's do this. Let's crank him out. Another suplex. No, 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 no. Oh, it is elimination. Okay. Wow, I was scared for a second. <laughs> oh, great, now the match is going to be just like this the whole time. All right, uh, seizure warning, I guess. Seizure warning for all the people. All right, Eddie, let me pin him. Let me pin him. Why are you... Oh, stand there. Yeah, stand there. Okay, cool. Good, good. I'm glad the AI isn't quite that dumb. It just let me, like, not get the pin. Just break it up and, like, yeah, make it easier. Just you and me, dude. Oh, crap, crap, crap. Nope. Nope. No. Ti eh, no title shot for you. <laughs> okay. Gonna do punches. Okay. Now, what is my special that I get to have out of the grapple? He was not using the uh, code breaker at this time. Uh, what the heck is it gonna be? One more move. I'll do a little of that. Okay. Post pose. Ooh. No, no, no. Reverse, please. Oh no, that's not a reverse. Okay. And one of these. Cool. Ooh, I got him. I got him. Power bombs. Oh, double power bomb! Double power bomb! Go for the pit! Come on, pull him up away! Nope. Okay, hold on. Okay, hold on, hold on. Let me face this way. Come on. Yes, I think I got him. I think I got him. One more double power bomb. He's in the middle of the ring. That's a pin. That's a pin and win, baby. That's a pin and win, baby. Yes. For the win, Chris Jericho, number one contender, in a sweet seven and a half minutes. Awesome. Good time. Good time. Yeah, we already know what that looked like. We did it twice before. We did it. We won. We're contenders. Number one contender. So, from here, um, what, are we going to get, like, a match against Malenko to place? Always save. Save early, save often. Yep, number one contender. Here we go. Okay, we're on SmackDown. Is this going to be just like some filler match until we get to a pay-per-view event or something? Oh, times like this, I wish I could do a great uh, Jericho impression. 
Oh, I'm Chris Jericho. I do the stuff that I don't know. What voice did I give this dude? It's like some generic crap. So you're the number one contender and you want a shot at this title? I got two words for you. Anytime. Anywhere. Well, those are two words. So I'll give you that. So, yeah. No time limit. Uh, 20 count. Uh, yes, there are DQs. Yes, there's all the other stuff. And we're fighting. Normal single match rule apply. Have fun. Uh, is you ever tired of that joke yet? <laughs> yes. Let's do this thing. I know I can lose, but I don't want to lose. I want to win! That's a Nacho Libre reference for you. And, yeah. All right, let's start off strong. One of the two, two of the greatest ring technicians of all time. Two of the greatest mat wrestlers. Now, one thing I want to try and do is, I know I can, must be able to do special moves as a, like a on-ground submission, right? I want to freaking put people in the walls of Jericho and win the match like that. So that's what I'm going to try to do. Oh, come on, are you serious? Great. Alright, so Grand Match of Sexy is coming out. Even though he has nothing against me other than the fact that he lost a match that I was also in. I'm pretty sure... Wasn't it Eddie that pinned you in the last match? I, I had... Right? Or am I incorrect? Am I incorrect? Come on, grab. Cool. Oh, crap. If I take long enough, I know that he'll just, like, not go anywhere, so... Ha! Eh, get by the... Ah, oh, man, I try to bump him out of the ring. And... Nope. People getting in the way. Everybody's grabbing everybody. Okay. Uh, how much longer do I have to deal with this nonsense and being blocked on my offense? Nope. 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 Oh, nice little tilt-a-whirl back suplex for no reason. And I'm getting punched. Cool. Just what I like to see. Yeah! Ah, I did it. I hit somebody. Oh, nice. Did not mean to do a drop toe hold on him, but I did it. And now I'm getting a running bulldog. Right. Oh, you guys suck. Ha! Nope. Nope, don't throw drop kicks at me. And there we go. And no oh crap. He's too fast. He's just too dang fast. Uh -huh. Yeah, yeah, distract yourselves. Distract yourselves. Ooh, okay, come on. Please leave. Please leave. I'd appreciate that if you just left forever now. Oh boy, this is great. This is just great. So something tells me that only the strongest of players are only supposed to win this match. And double atomic drop. Hooray. Thankfully I don't have butt implants that would have exploded. Oh boy. Let's see, hold on, I'm gonna... No! No! Whoops. I didn't get DQ'd? Holy crap! Awesome! <laughs> I meant to throw it at Grand Match of Sex A, thinking that, oh, he's not in the match. I can't get DQ'd for that. But no, of course I freaking uh, throw it at the wrong guy. Oh, double hip toss. Yep, this ain't good. I think, uh, yeah, I, I, I think your boy's going to go down with an L on this one. This is how we're going to end the episode. On a loss. That was totally unfair, by the way. And besides, isn't this supposed to be a no DQ match? Isn't this, like, absolutely the definition of disqualification? Oh, it's just a powerbomb and a replay. And I'm getting updazed. Alright, just, just, just have your way with me. Just, you got me for the evening. Just do it. I guess I'll try, damn it. Aha. Uh -huh. Something. Yeah, there's no way I'm going to be able to do anything with freaking Grandmaster Sexay waiting in the wings. So I'm just going to go ahead and keep throwing suplexes. Uh, no. Oh, now he's finally out? He's finally out. How freaking long was that? That was a good solid three minutes of nonsense. Having to deal with that. No, don't small package. No, 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 no. Okay. All right. Let's see. And send you flying. I said send you... F Damn it. Butthole. Alright, one more of these. Okay, a couple of taunts. 
Okay, or at least one taunt. Alright, yes, let's get back on top. Okay, I have a chance, I think. Oh, nope! No takedown for you, mister. Oh, come on. Oh! Can't try to chop me? Okay. Alright, let's do this thing, let's do this thing. Up with you, up with you, up with you, yes, okay. So, uh, position... Boom, alright. Let's see if I can use two of them back to back. Screw it, I, I don't have time to try the freaking walls of Jericho. I just gotta do it. Okay. He might be too close to the rope, so I gotta come up top, maybe? Come over the top of him? Oh, he's coming up with a daze, alright. Okay, swing around. Do the quick move. Uh, oh, nice little stall suplex. I didn't know I had this. Cool. So this should be the last move of the game. No, he's gonna get up. He's... St oh, crap. You're kidding me, right? You're, you, you, you've you you've gotta be flipping dipping me. No! You're not getting a comeback like that. You will take the L. Mm. Alright. Great. Just do something. Thank you. That please be enough. He took two of my finishers. He can't kick out, right? On cue, right on cue. Alright. Well that's it. You gotta be heckin' kidding me. Oh no. <laughs> my special on the ground is a cocky pin. Cool. Okay, no, no, dude, come on. Come on. Ooh, tilt a world backbreaker. Oh, that looked pretty sexy. Now is it enough? Yeah? Hey, cool, awesome. Okay, so I'm guessing that if I want to use my special on the ground, he has to be on his back. Even though the walls of Jericho usually comes from the feet. I don't know, I'll try that later. I don't care. I won. I did it. Extended length episode where I won the title on an episode of SmackDown and not in a pay-per-view But that's cool. That's cool um, This match is ruled a no contest due to the interference on sexy That's my Howard Finkel impression, which is eh, 70% Therefore the World Wrestling Federation light heavyweight champion is still Malenko Yeah, that's what I was wondering the whole freaking time so all right, I won the match by interference, even though I got the pin. Now I kind of wonder what would have happened if I would have lost. Ooh. You know, that's how they get you. That's how they add the replay value to this game. Even though you're going to play with your friends, you're going to fight each other in various fun things, whatever. That is where we're going to end today's episode. Thank you so much for watching, everybody. I do appreciate you coming along. Go ahead and subscribe if you haven't already done so. Press a like, leave a comment down below, and share the crap out of this with all your friends. Next time, we will see you in Chapter 3 of this Light Heavyweight Championship playthrough. See you later.